Are you prepared to stand trial and profess your guilt or innocence before the seven? We need to trust each other. We have so many enemies now. The Freys and the Lannisters send their regards. What do you want? I thought you knew what I wanted. Tell them what you did to her. Tell him! Are you afraid? Good. You're in the great game now. And the great game is terrifying. Transitional shot. Who knows? But it looked pretty cool. You get the thing with uh, Jon Snow and Sansa saying they've got to trust each other because they've got loads of enemies, which are obviously Freys, Lannisters. Um, obviously, the North isn't theirs yet. Uh, there's still quite a lot of houses that are still probably loyal to, you know, the King Tommen, Tommen, and uh, will still rally against him. And maybe Jaime Lannister will be next. His next mission will be to kill Jon Snow and stop them. Um, to see Sansa and Peter Baelish having like a little sort of conversation after obviously the Battle for Winterfell and he's like, obviously Sansa's been talking to her about why he came, what he's doing, blah blah blah. He's like, I thought you knew what I wanted or whatever his accent is at this time. So I assume it obviously means that he just wants We see, a, we see a little bit of Bran in the trailer, so that's what could be for the bird. We see a little bit of Bran. Um, hopefully Bran's story will sort of lead up to the oh my god finishing moment. Um, we have the conflict that I was hoping for, the conflict between Davos and the Red Woman uh, because of uh, the burning. So hopefully um, we'll see. I, I don't know how it's going to turn out. Because she's obviously going to be, she's guilt, probably feel guilty for it, considering that she just killed her for no reason, because now it's still lost. Um, I don't know, I don't know how it's going to turn out. Maybe Davos just kills her, possibly, but they kind of need her, or do they? Not really. They don't need her. No, they'll probably just kill her. Hopefully. Um, we'll see uh, Daenerys having a little, little heart to heart with uh, Dario. Um, whether or not he sails with her to Marine. Uh, from Marine to Westeros, but Tyrion says she's in the great game now, and the great game is scary. So that hopefully, please, that means that she is leaving finally, going across the narrow sea, and getting to Westeros next season. Hopefully, please. Otherwise, by the time she gets there, she'll be an ice cube, a deserted ice cube, with loads of white walkers and whites and other monstrosities walking. Um, but yeah, it looks like it looks like it's gonna be one of those episodes where it's like gonna be like a nice rounding off episode. Um, I don't know. I get the impression that not so many major things are gonna happen. No big revelations, but I could be wrong. Probably I'm wrong. It's pro I'm hoping that this like uh, rounds off some stories and loose ends that have been brilliant throughout the entire season, and then having a massive oh my god moment at the end, leading into next season. But only time will tell. In a week's time, we'll know, and it will be the end. The end of everything. Uh, no more Game of Thrones for another year, at least. And apparently, well, not apparently, it's confirmed that only next season's going to be seven episodes. There better be seven good long episodes. None of this... I mean... Uh, okay, like... Okay. Nerys gets to Westeros, right? So next season she gets to Westeros. 
How long is it going to take you to destroy everything? Or not destroy everything, but even get going? You can guarantee there's going to be some bullshit. Who she gets kidnapped again and has to go, I don't know, she goes somewhere else and has to come back. But it would be nice if maybe she goes to Dawn first, perhaps? Gets them on board. I don't know. Strange. Weird one. Depending on where she lands in Westeros, sort of, it would be interesting to see other places we haven't really seen much of. Maybe? I don't know. Let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, they've, they've. Wait a minute. Can't they not. Wait, did they have to wait? Did she say she was going to wait for. Joran? Did she wait for Joran? Or not? Has he got to come to her? To her after he's found the cure? Nah, she's leaving behind. Um, yeah, so we'll see you next week what it's like. Um, we'll, I'll do a video about speculation for next season after that episode's aired. And uh, yeah, we'll see uh, episode 10 next week. Winds of winter.